Hello everybody, what is up? Okay, so I know this video will not be seen for a while, but with that being said, if you are seeing this, it is because I am 12 weeks pregnant at this time, 12 or 13 weeks pregnant, and I am so ecstatic, I am so happy. I know a lot of people are going to see this and it's like a judgmental thing because I am only 19 but you have to realize I'm not in this situation as a lot of other 19 year olds are you know I have always wanted to be a mom obviously I went through like that bad teenager phase where I was like <laughs> no I never want to have kids but now after having one and carrying literally carrying growing birthing a human and now loving that human, there is no greater gift on this earth for me personally. Like, being a mom is just, it's everything and more. It's the hardest job, one with, you don't get many acknowledgements for, but it's the most rewarding in the sense of when your baby touches you or kisses you or the first time she's ever going to tell me she loves me back, like, it's so rewarding. So I have a few clips here, I'm going to explain really quickly about me finding out because I'm going to throw that clip in here and it's just not going to make a lot of sense if I just put it up as a video. So that whole week I had been eating a lot. It is September 11th today and I found out September 5th. I had been eating a lot, I had been crying, we went to Popeyes and they were out of that new chicken sandwich and I cried about it and I was like, that's it, I'm not driving anymore and it was just weird, like, I knew I was about to start my period so I was just like, I'm about to start my period, I'm like heavily PMSing and that's it, that's what it is. But I took a test, it was completely negative and it was four days before my missed period. And then I took a test, the day I was supposed to start my period and it was a blazing positive. So when I took the other test, I had recorded just in case I was pregnant, the first test I had took this month, and it was a negative, so I just stopped recording because obviously nobody's ever going to see that. So I just assumed the second one was going to be negative as well, so I decided to not record, and Stevie was in the room with me, and I was just taking it, peed in the cup, took the test, and I like glanced back at the test because it wasn't the three minutes yet. I had like literally waited like 30, 45, 60 seconds. And then I like, glanced and I saw like a very dark two lines. Like there was two lines. And like in that video, what you see is literally, I see that, I immediately put my camera on, phone on, and I'm like sitting there for like two seconds like what do I do? I pull up my pants real quick and I ran to my roommate's room and shut her door. Because I wanted to tell her because I was freaking out. I was like crying. I couldn't. Like I was literally shaking this hard like this. And um, the thing about that is Stevie's little suspicious booty saw her door closed. And I think you can hear it in the video because I just let my phone keep playing even though you're looking at a ceiling fan. He says from outside of the door, you're pregnant. And she, my roommate Haley was like, are you going to tell him? And I was like, I think I should. So then you see me go over and I'm crying and I'm scared and I tell him I don't want to go through a miscarriage again. And I just cry. So here's that clip now. Yeah? On your 
decided to play the song Speechless because I had listened to that earlier in the day and I cried to it. Before I knew I was pregnant, I was crying to that song. And I decided to play it once I found out and like collected myself a little bit because I just wanted to like dance with Harper. Like, I don't know, I was excited and I was scared and I felt so many different emotions. So I just wanted to dance with Harper and immediately it came on and my roommate got a small clip of me crying because she was like you're gonna cry and I was like no I'm not and immediately the song's playing and I start crying so I will play that clip for you guys now too <laughs> I want to make Harper a big sister. I want to carry this baby full term. I want to do all those things. Because like I said, being a mom is so amazing and so great. So my very first pregnancy, I told everybody right away. And my second pregnancy, I didn't tell some people until I was 20 weeks. Most people didn't know till I was past 11 weeks for sure with Harper. So I took my first digital test. I'll insert that picture that I took, the little aesthetic picture. I am pregnant. I have scheduled my first doctor's appointment. It is in two weeks. I believe I'm... I'm about to be five weeks pregnant. I know that. So I'm only five weeks pregnant. Um, I am still breastfeeding Harper, so I have, like, cramps, but... Which... The cramps, they scare me, obviously, because of miscarriage. But I'm trying to be as optimistic and positive as possible this time around. I, uh, I just want to speak it into existence. This baby is going to make it. I'm going to carry it to full term. And I'm going to have two children under two. And it's going to be madhouse. But it's going to be the best thing, like one of the greatest gifts. I'm excited, and I'm scared, and I'm probably all the emotions you could feel. I don't feel nauseous. I feel like I'm hungry a lot, eating a lot. Um, my skin just started breaking out. As you can see, it's like one, two, three, four. So, as of right now, I am pregnant, and I am happy. And I hope that if you're watching me for the first time, that you follow us on this journey. If you're going through something similar, or if you're just going through pregnancy alone, I am here for you. I'm excited for you. And just know it is the greatest gift one can ask for. So. Mm -hmm.